Pisces, come on in, put your feet up, make yourselves at home. I'm Jen Dawson, welcome to Gen TV. All right, Pisces. This is, this is a video about, I'm feeling like they're using you. I'm feeling like you're being used by this person. So let's take a look at that. A little meditation before this and felt a little emotional so my makeup's kind of running everywhere <laughs> this, this is what i felt i felt in my meditation though it's like pisces getting used by someone it's time to get out bear in mind my loves these are general readings so it's not going to resonate with all of you, but if it does, take a look in the description box below. There's a link to my Patreon if you want to watch extended videos. There's also a link to my website if you want to book a private reading. You can only book a private reading with me via my website. You have to go to my website. That's the only way. You go to gentvtarot.com. You think you can't do it without them? You can't exist without them. You can't move forwards without them. So the overall vibe here, we've got the Nine of Pentacles in reverse. This is what I'm thinking. You, you, you feel like you need them because of it, the Two of Cups, you need them to feel whole. You need them to feel secure, even financially. What you need to know right now is like, this is a karmic relationship. This is karma here. This is, this is not your big love. This is someone who is using you. What are, they, what are they using you for? There's a lot of pentacles here. Are you uh, doing all right financially? Or do you come from like family money or something? Or you just, you, you just earn enough and this person's kind of coming in and leaving you a little bit without. It doesn't, mean, it doesn't have to necessarily mean that you're rich but you earn enough money to pay your bills, have some good food in the house, and this person's just like taking advantage of that. It does look like it's a, there's a lot of pentacles here. And trophy. So it, it sort of feels like in a way you are a, a trophy to this person. They can go around saying, this is my guy, this is my girl. Because you're hot, basically. And people envy them when they're with you. <laughs> they kinda they kinda feel like this dude, like, yeah. That's all I'm really picking up from that card. It's like... It's sort of a, a, a bit of a boss energy. A bit of a, like, lording it over their mates. Because they got you. And that's either something to do with your financial status or, you know, a bit of both, really. Your financial status and how fine looking you are. There's no uh, feeling here of genuine emotion. Status is, is the word that's coming. Anything else? There's not a lot of emotion. 
But you see the king here has the uh, the bird blindfolded and resting. I'm in charge of the bird. The bird comes flying back to me when I click my fingers. <sighs> They've got you where they, where they want you. That's what it looks like. It doesn't look good for them though. Coming up in the near future. The Wheel of Fortune in reverse. It's called the Wheel of the Year in this deck. I get annoyed, I do. I get a little bit annoyed when decks call things other things. It's nice when they've got new cards. Aside from, you know, the other ones that are already there. New and different ones, yeah, that's cool. I just don't like them renaming the ones that are already, you know. I'm just a stickler, I'm a stickler. It's coming up in the near future. That's my leather boots, they're squeaking. <coughs> I'm pulling out a widget. Um, it, it's it, it's not a what's coming up the deception getting away with something I felt this in Pisces readings before that, that there's cheating going on I'm not getting any other cards suggesting it other than that at the moment? I, I sort of feel like it's not cheating with a lot of people. I feel like it's somebody in particular, somebody, one person, not, I don't see there being a lot of options. Tell me more about that. It's a, uh, it's an escape for them. Uh, it's escapism. Uh, they don't actually care about this person. They don't care about this person, you know why? Because they don't have money. <laughs> and you know what they're doing? They're using your money. If they, if this person's like saying to you, I could have borrow like, can I borrow $20? Can I borrow some money? I want to borrow like 50 bucks. They're taking that money and going out with this other person, spending your money on, on this other person. I you know, kind of... Kind of getting that vibe. Don't like it. Money's a thing, though. You know, we've got we've got a lot of pentacles coming up. A lot of pentacles. Mm -hmm. Loads of, yeah. I might bring back so you can sort of see in one half of the screen that. The, uh, the cards. I liked it, but nobody seemed not bothered, so I stopped doing it. It was a lot of work. Um, why is why is the five of wands here? It sort of looks like you. If you were to look, and I think I said this on last week's video as well. If you were to look, you would find stuff that you don't want to see about this person that will. Put a halt to it. You're gonna find things that you don't like. You'll probably find out there is somebody in particular that they're uh, they're having an affair with somebody, a proper affair with somebody, not lots of people. It's just one person. Why is the fire 
No, sorry, why is the Ten of Pentacles here for you? It looks like the you're you're cutting them out. So the energy I'm getting here is that you're freezing them out now. It's it's hard for you. You're heartbroken. I've got the three of cups here like laying down and the, the two cups here standing still. It's very difficult for you to, to see that there's anything to look forward to in this sense. It's the end of this, this it's coming to the end of this though. We've got them. We've got the seven of ones in reverse. It's like they, they, they're giving up. When it comes to it and you find out what's going on, they're not going to fight for you. They're not. They're. They're not going to show you that you actually mean anything to them. They're not. That's what always bothers me about relationships. Any relationship that I've ever known of, when when somebody's like, I don't want to be with you anymore. The other person's just like, oh, and they give up. They don't fight for it. And this person, you know, at least put up a little bit of a fight if you love this person. No, right? Let's do ten of cups here for the outcome. Well, this ending is, it kind of benefits you in a way. The, the, something's coming in. I'm listening. I'll, I'll tell you when I hear it. This benefits you, this ending. It just means that, you know, you have time to build a new life. Uh, slowly moving towards the next chapter of your life, which is this. It just looks like... You're being used by somebody who they see you as a trophy and they're a bit of a gold digger. Even if you're not rich, this person spends your money. I, I, a friend of mine years ago had, had this. They lived with this guy and uh, gosh, she worked really hard. Uh, she worked, uh, she was like a receptionist in a, 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 in those studios where people exercise. She worked all hours and uh, took her money home and he wasn't working. He was a bit of a couch potato. He wasn't working, but uh, he took all of her money and spends it on prostitutes, <laughs> which was just like, oh my God, what? She was she was really lovely to him and, and you know, lovely lass, but he uh, totally broke her with that one. She worked so hard and really believed in him. He was a DJ. DJs. I was married to a DJ. <laughs> Going out, partying, boozing. Um, so, yeah. I'm going to take this into the extended. I'm going to ask about this person for you. I'm going to ask, where are you in their heart space? How do they feel about you? How do they see you? What are their intentions towards you? What do they want to say to you? And some guidance from the universe. But let's pull you. A couple of oracle cards. Emotions are running high. Faux sure. You're going to find something out pretty soon. But luck is on your side. This ending is in your best interest. Let me spill my cup of tea. Just got some message through from my mommy then saying, How are you both? That's nice. Del Shannon, run away. Wishing you were here by me to end this misery and I wonder. Yeah, I'll just stop there because I'm not great. But... Anyway, th thanks for joining me. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. And if you want to watch the extended, take a look at the description box below. There's a link to my Patreon. You'll find the vid there.